Hi friends, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. In today's video, I'm going to share with you how I make this boring white lampshade into something glam and beautiful. So I picked up this lampshade from my local hotel liquidation center and the first thing I did was I cleaned it with some bleach and water and they had some spots on here but the bleach and water not only disinfected the lampshade but it also bleached it clean and then I sat it outside in the sun so now that it is dry I am using this satin black spray paint to spray paint the this white shade black now I told you that you're going to begin to see more black pop up in my home decor and this is just the first DIY that I'm going to share with you where we'll begin to incorporate black Now when you're spray painting, you need to make sure, especially when it's a, a big surface, that you cover the entire surface and then let that dry and then you go back over and paint it. Now this um, DIY took me four cans of spray paint and then I'm using this sponge um, paintbrush here so that I can get some texture onto this um onto the um, lampshade and you see when you're covering white you're gonna need a lot a lot of spray paint so i had this this spray paint was the best spray paint i also had some other spray paint that was not so good so i must say that this spray paint was one of the best spray paints that i have used now this is what the lampshade looks like now that it is dry and you see there is like texture all over it and I want in those areas when the light is on you can actually see through the um, lampshade and I don't want that and this and this is the second lampshade actually and I just wanted to make sure that I got a lot of texture on here and so that's why I am I'm painting this with the can real close up to the lampshade and then I'm going over it with the padding um, motion on this lampshade so I let this dry and make sure guys when you do this you're out in a ventilated area and once it's dry uh, this is this is the lamp that I am going to use these lamps are in my foyer area and originally these the lampshades on here was just white and so the, the lampshades that I picked up at the hotel liquidation center they were only five dollars a piece and I love the shape of them because they are like oval or oblong and I think that that brings a lot of dramatic effect to the lampshade so I went to the at home store and they have a huge array of finials and I picked up these finials here they were $5.99 a piece they had a variety of shades a variety of colors and shapes but these are the ones that I thought that would look great because it had the clear and it also had the gold base Now this DIY took me a day and a half because I needed time in between for the spray paint to actually dry and I needed time to go out and find the finials and this is the final look guys. I love it. I love the texture. There's some areas where it's shiny and then it's matte and it really came out great and the other um, um, element that I love is that you can't see through it and so I am really happy with how this DIY came together if you are looking to upcycle some old lampshades that you have this is one that is very inexpensive and because I use white and every time I went to the store for the Hobby Lobby I used my 20 my 40% off coupon so a $6.99 can only cost me three dollars and some change so twelve dollars and the ten dollars so twenty two dollars for two lampshades I don't think I did bad so guys I hope you enjoyed today's video as we glamify these lampshades that are now housed in my foyer I think it really um, brings a lot of dramatics to this area and I am really loving the overall look and the feel when you come into the home. So guys if you are new to Wani's house I would love for you to subscribe so go ahead hit that subscribe button 
also hit that notification bell so that you won't miss any of my upcoming uploads if you like videos like this like this give me a thumbs up so i'll know that you are really digging what i am giving so guys i'm gonna go ahead in this video but before i do you know what i always say the next time you're in town you can always stop by Wani's house and i'll see you in the next video bye bye